So a lot of people are curious about our off-grid living and there's a shot of our uh, our solar panels. We have a uh, 2000 watt solar array. The lower um, panels there are set for the angle of the summer sun. The ones above we set them for the winter sun because obviously the angle out here changes. And we do have most of the conveniences of home. Um, we don't have a TV. We don't watch TV. So that we don't miss that. We don't have a microwave. I don't miss that. In the winter when it's cold, what we do to conserve on energy is we put the refrigerator outside. Obviously it's not plugged in. Um, and the freezer will be coming out here also. We heat our house with wood. And um, we heat the water with the wood um, stove too. Uh, my husband has it uh, set up uh, that way. Uh, here is our charge controllers. And right now, um, the ones that are set for the winter are, um, we have about 242 watts coming in. The battery bank's at 27.6. And uh, this other one that's set for the other angle is 227 watts. So this is our big inverter that inverts all the electricity from uh, direct current to um, um, the current inside the house. And this little thing here tells us that we're inverting DC 27.8. We've got six amps going right now, so something's plugged in. Um, this is just our shop area. We've got our stove out here because um, we have a cooktop inside and we just do um, propane. So. <laughs> So I did laundry today because the sun was out. Um, we have a regular washing machine in there. And I dry the clothes out here. We don't use the dryer. And um, also during the summer when we're not using the wood heat, we have an on-demand um, system. So that's propane and it heats the water. And uh, this is our shower setup. So pretty simple. But uh, we don't live like savages. <laughs> a lot of people think we give up a lot of the conveniences of home, but uh, we also compost our own uh, waste. This is, uh, uh, we have sawdust in here. We have a regular toilet just for the urine that flushes out front, um, but we do compost our own waste.